What's up guys, NDM Tech here. Apple introduced a pressure sensitive display with the Apple Watch and named it Force Touch. They used the same technology in the MacBook's trackpad. Now with the iPhone 6s, they introduced 3D Touch. And today we're going to see what's the difference between Force Touch and 3D Touch. 3D Touch was first introduced with the iPhone 6s. The pressure sensitive panel is situated under the backlight layer. The main feature of the 3D Touch is it can sense up to two types of pressure soft pressure and hard pressure and Apple calls it peak and pop. If you give a slight pressure on a link you can peak the link and if you give more pressure on the same link and the link opens and that's how the 3D touch works. Force touch was first introduced in the Apple watch then in the MacBook trackpad. Force touch can sense only a specific amount of pressure so that if you force touch on a screen then the software reacts according to it. When compared to the 3D touch 3D Touch can sense up to two types of pressure. So that's the reason why Apple calls the technology in the iPhone 6s as 3D Touch and not Force Touch. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you guys in the next video.